Octopus User Manual Octopus K212 is MBD's unique SD card application that provides a highly interactive learning environment to the learner. It can run on Android and Windows 10 and above devices such as mobile phones, tablets, desktops and laptops. Each SD card contains content for science and mathematics for one grade. Firstly, insert the SD card or memory card in your device. Once an SD card is installed and activated on one device, it cannot be used on any other device. Go to the SD card through File Manager to get the Octopus R29.apk file. Click the file to install the app in the device. Internet connection is required for the first time to activate product. Otherwise, it is a completely offline product. Click on Accept button to accept any terms. You can access the various functions within the app via the home screen or by tapping this menu icon. The home screen is gateway page to both the subjects and displays the number of days remaining for the course to expire on the top right corner. Tap on any of the subjects on the home screen or the main menu to reach the chapter screen of that subject. It provides the list of topics or chapters which takes you directly to its module or content. Each chapter indicates on the top left corner the number of concepts in it. To search a topic, tap the search icon on the top right and type in the keyword. Each chapter consists of two components which are accessible via tabs on the top right corner of the screen. These are Concepts and Assessment. The concepts appear by default when one selects a chapter. The screen lists down all the videos within that chapter. Tap on any of the video to view it. Skeleton of Vertebrates Animals around us have different types of skeleton. A hard framework inside or outside the body of an animal is called a skeleton. Vertebrates have skeleton inside their bodies. The skeleton inside the body of an animal is called an endoskeleton. The assessment tab lists down the available assessment within a chapter. These are listed by topics or chapter name. The users are allowed to take multiple attempts. To begin, select any of the desired topic and tap on Add Attempt. Tap on Start Attempt to begin the assessment. A random test of 10 questions will be generated for each attempt. Tap on the desired answer to proceed to next question. Submit and review your scores. After assessment has been submitted, the results are in effect for user to view. The user may add more attempts as desired by tapping on the Add Attempt button. They may also remove or delete an attempt by tapping on the Bin icon on an attempt. Similarly, to view the score of a completed attempt, tap on the I icon. The course is valid for one year. The app will lock the content on device past the course end date and the user will be redirected to this screen.